Oh, what's up guys, welcome back from the Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro Duel video, next match, Crawl's Banlist Cup, fourth match of the tournament, here in Group B, second match, we have Chaos from back in 2003, OECG Chaos, by the way, uh, is paired up against Legendary 6 Samurai from 2011, a couple of weeks legal back then, since it was so overpowered back then, with, you know, Triple Gateway, Triple United, etc. The Chaos list, on the other hand, is again OECG from 2003, as you see from a couple of cards, like Crush Card Virus, Sixth Sense, for example, was um, legal, was released in the OCG, but not yet, of course, in the TCG. More, a little bit heavy, chaos-oriented with double BLS as well. I believe BLS was, was at three at that point. Um... Same for the Thunder Dragon, again boosting up those discards and of course the light amounts in your deck and graveyard. So, which deck has the advantage? Um, well, depends, right? Going first, Six Samurai can set up like a Xi'an, negating a possible spell, you know, from the opponent. Can be quite important, then again, if Chaos decides to start or has a chance to start, that hand disruption has been quite important, as we saw in the previous tournament. So, let's see a couple, or at least let's start with the first duel. Alright, first game, Chaos gets to start, this is an okay opening hand, definitely a very nice opening with a pot of greed, immediately netting you a plus one, uh, drawing two cards right, your apprentice magician is definitely a nice tech, immediately searching out uh, magician of fate for example, which is of course a light, and also magical scientist, which is a dark, and that's definitely possible if you, you know, your opponent doesn't have any like a beat stick after that, so your scientist will survive the battle phase. Um, again, yeah, being the, the, the recruiter, you know, good old school Yu-Gi-Oh was somewhat, at least depends on the era, right? But uh, cards like Mystic Tomato, Apprentice Magician, Shining Angel, uh, there have been times where these cards were kind of good, maybe with Creature Swap, but again, holding off the opponent during the battle phase and possibly digging your deck for something like Sangen or Witch of the Black Forest in case of Mystic Tomato. Definitely going to use or try to use Call of the Haunted on Apprentice Magician, you know, possibly search out another magician of fate or maybe the magical scientist to you know prevent myself from getting damage but of greed again got the deck from magician of fate you can do graceful charity must be nice definitely going to send the thunder dragon from my hand to the graveyard to net two searches i have enough lights in my graveyard so there is no reason to discard the second one you know um and here ah the power of time seal chained into the chaos emperor and now yep six samurai is like a terrible deck um if it's um top decking you know with all the dead continuous spells for, uh, for example, and Chaos has the advantage of Sinister Serpent, you know, and with Time Seal, the opponent is locked out of his draw phase during his next turn. Although it does top deck into a monster, and that could be a problem, especially now with Six Sense not going off. Well, only, well, worst case scenario, like, well, 1 2. Doesn't really matter, you know, setting up the grave. This is not Dragon Rulers, but you know what I mean. I called 5 and 6, but sadly not hitting that. Um, do top deck into a nice floater slash um, recruiter alike. Cartwright, both Sengen here and the Witch can definitely seal the deal. So a super exciting game number one, but game number two, the opponent gets to start, and that's something you know that Six Samurai wants to opening with either United, but most preferred is of course Gateway to get those free searches and free summons protecting by Shen as well and going second um, Tsukuyomi okay can potentially put the Shen phase down and maybe follow it up with, with uh, something like Dark Hole or Raigeki but that's like too good to be true right um, Metamorphosis not going to help me now uh, Delinquent Duo okay can get rid of both his uh, cards in hand maybe he maybe yeah forcing out the Shen negate and bluffing like a Dark Hole maybe this was good but again Grandmaster will activate when destroyed by a card effect so he can just get back the Grandmaster itself, right? So uh, it's not going too well. I'm not really sure which attribute I have in the graveyard. The dark, well, Sangan can search like a light monster, the magi Magician of Fate to just normal summon Magician next turn, use Metamorphosis, and I believe it's a cost, right? To send it to the graveyard, Shen will, or at least probably, will negate the Thousand Astro Stick or the Metamorphosis, right? And then BLS would be live, but nope, I'm not going to survive this one. So the all uh, so important game number three, ah, the hand disruption coming clutch again, painful choice eventually setting up the grave and thanks to Call of the Haunted, I can potentially get back Dark Magician of Chaos. 
that's a good move on his part using Dark Hole, but unfortunate for him. Again, Six Samurai do have um, some problems with high attack monsters. And here during the battle phase, use a Call of the Haunted on Dark Magician of Chaos, and now just racking up the advantage. Use Six Sense, Call Five um, and Six, and the, I believe the Five was hit. So, five free draws. Again, must be nice. And now, yeah, with all that card advantage, I can just drop everything and gotta lock my opponent. Not really sure, no. Yeah, it doesn't really matter, right? I can go for a game, I think. Yeah, indeed. So the Yatta Lock didn't really matter that much. So kind of a clutch game. Game number one, game number three. But that's how it is, right? So Chaos take the two points. Six Samurai takes the one um, point. Next cross list match should be uploaded soon. Like maybe Sunday. Depends on, you know, the other support and card releases from the new sets in the OCG. Um, okay, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching and feel free to leave a card or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave them signing out. Peace.